guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episodes 3 and 4 of season 4 of Working. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 3. And 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, summertime? Mind you, I just stayed up all night helping my mom and then also watching Attack on Titan over again. I literally just finished season one a couple of minutes ago, so I'm like, ugh. <laughs> and I am sleepy, even though you can't see it on my face. Because <laughs> it's like seven in the morning and I'm like, bruh, how did I do this? <laughs> like, don't be like me. And stay up especially when you're cooking at the same time because she needed help and I was like okay I'll help and such and we were trying to watch something to keep her awake and everything and I was like well I still gotta get myself done so she wanted to watch something kind of scary and I was like well Attack on Titan's not really scary but it has like you know gory moments so you might like it she fell she fell asleep during like the first 10 minutes of episode one so she kept going off <laughs> which is so funny and then I finished it like less than a half hour ago so about 6 30 and I'm like damn I because like I, as right now I am so sleepy as I said you can't see it on my face but I am super duper sleepy and I have two more things to do after I'm done watching this and I want to get it all done today so I can upload everything because one thing has to be live today and the other two for later but your girl is sleepy. <laughs> I might even be sleeping all day today. Who knows? What's your face? No. Who are you? Your voice is familiar. I wouldn't even be surprised if it's someone I know, because I bet it is. I, yeah, I don't think she is. <laughs> I mean, it's not Higa's fault. He was just asking. Yeah, because she's got the, the spirits around her. Really, just one, honestly. Mia, hold up. But y'all don't see that. Oh my god. Mia, look, look, look really closely, honey. And look, she got two of them around her. What? That laugh is so... I'm trying to think. Let 
me think about I gotta listen to her like do a couple of sentences. Right? <laughs> Her cry. He go. What the hell is wrong with you? I know it. I know her voice. Oh, no, wait, I'm gonna give it a guy. Is that Chino? That's that has to be her VA because that that sounds so much like her. Okay, maybe. Ah. For a moment, I thought she was like a second year or something. But she cute. Oh, poor Miri. Miri? Third time out. You can't be wording things like that. I mean, come on now. Oh, God. Boy, Meany, she's so short. Poor baby. Of course, she's a part of the group now. And because of the fact that you two kind of know each other, so of course she's going to be invited everywhere. I mean, in a way, y'all all, all kind of survive with, you know, Mita and her ghosts. Of course, these two would end together. <laughs> oh, that's our goddess for you. <laughs> what indeed? Baby, oh my god. But you you telling me no one. Not even what you was supposed to teach him more Japanese. Yeah, who is he made his father? Really? Nah uh Exactly. That's what we want to know. <laughs> You'll get lost, yeah.
years old. <laughs> Wait, you're gonna get lost. So what happened? Why'd you run back here? This is like that one episode of the quintessential quintuplets with my best girl and the main boy carved hands and <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so in a way everybody had their own little version of test of courage I mean, okay, hold on. Since a bear ate the food and everything, shouldn't it just be better if you all just go out to eat? I mean, it is late. Something could be open still. <laughs> Poor Mia. I mean, I really wouldn't say that. His family is different. That too. Are you serious? Yeah, I, I mean, no, they, they just not normal. His family ain't normal either. You two will have the best things in common. Imagine these, oh my God. Um, imagine these two getting married. <laughs> I mean, well, yeah, we know, but still, <laughs> don't be rash. That too. <laughs> 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 
See, that just says your destinies are entwined, no matter what. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, my God. See, Shio is that one rich chick who, you know, she seems very, very cute, but she's really into a lot of deadly things. You know what? I'm okay with that. I think, uh, you know, she might have to be best girl for me. She reminds me of my, my favorite Persona character. You probably know who she is. If you play Persona 5. Oh, you I mean, you know. Oh, shit. See, mm. I would be so afraid for him. I, I pray for him. Just like last week. You pray for him last week. You pray for him this week. You pray for him for the rest of this dang series. Is there really a bear though? Oh, it's so fucking cool. Oh, a cutie patootie. Yeah, what exactly happened? The raccoon, obviously. Um, we need to take Higa to the doctor just in case he gets rabies or something. We don't want that though, but please take him to the doctors. Take him to the ER. I mean, what is it like nine o'clock at night? Yeah, the ER is still open. They open technically kind of probably what 24 seven. Yes. We seriously not going to take him to the ER. Yeah, good luck. Okay, I thought she he was also going to ask her, hey, can you also keep a raccoon for me? If he did that, I would have been like, Bless you. No, 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 no. Misunderstanding. They're just friends. They could be something more because, you know, they look good together. I think their families will love each other as well. <laughs> just imagine them at a family dinner. <laughs> She 
she's so cute. Come on, Yana. He's cute. You're adorable. Oh, God. Or you could go check on her yourself. I know, by the way you're saying that, it just seems like you two are more and more a couple. So, you know, just go ahead and say it. You two are a couple. <laughs> Even though you're not. Complicated. Mm -hmm. That's so nice of you, though. <laughs> oh, please don't. That has to be Chino's VA. I swear to God, if it's not, I'm gonna be pissed. She's already, Yana's already the best girl. She's adorable and I love her. I love her expressions, her resting bitch face, because she looks sleepy all the freaking time, but she's just so freaking adorable. But if that is not Chino Hesia, um, Itsuki, Itsuki from, uh, Quintessential Quintuple is my second best girl. If that ain't her, then I don't know who the VA is. But that is her. I know that voice. Come on, man. I've been watching Quint <laughs> Watching is the order of rabbit for how long now? It's been like a year, but come on. As someone who binged season one and season two, plus the OVAs, and now currently on season three, and wanting to watch that other show that she's in, the Sleeping Princess show, so bad just to see her asleep all the time because I'm like, me. Okay, but the test of courage was probably like the best thing about this episode. I mean, I think for me, I've always kind of wanted to do something like that. I don't know how the hell I'm getting all this energy at 7.30 in the morning, but I am. But still, yeah, I would like to do something like that. But really, um, I might have to be that person and be like, hey, I'm going to bring some weapons just in case because you don't know what to expect by doing this unless it's one of those where it's like mm, the trail hold on excuse me the trail is already planned which most are but you never know what the hell you might see out there so like let's say you're going on a half a mile hike on a, you know, test of courage trail and, you know, it's campers and, um, the head campers trying to scare the little kids and stuff like that. I've seen it in movies and I've seen it in TV shows, especially when it's like horror movies and horror TV shows because they, and usually some, some other animes that I've seen, but really more of like horror movies and horror TV shows where they do it. And it's supposed to be like... <laughs> it's like really scary but in the end it's not and such because usually sometimes especially when it is a horror movie and people don't realize that yeah people are getting killed on the sidelines and then you see a body and someone like oh my god that looks so life life and then they touch it and they're like um yeah <laughs> like if it was me I'd be like time out I'm ready to go home <laughs> 
<laughs> but I would try it just once just to see what it's like and stuff. I mean, as someone who loves the crap out of like anything being scared or horror movies in general and stuff like that, except where it's in a dire situation. So if it's only really to be scared, like for my entertainment and stuff like that, it's sweet. And that's why, I mean, like I haven't been to like a haunted house since like... 20... 2011? Yeah, 2011. I mean, there are some horror movies that make me, like, jump and a little, get a little jump scare on so much and then I just laugh at myself. But yeah, other than that, no. I can't even say the same th- with that with anime. I mean, yeah, there's, like, scenes exactly like I said with the movie where, like, I can jump and then I still laugh at myself a second later because I'm like, hmm... Why the hell was I scared about that? But yeah, I mean, honestly, yeah. If if it's a cute little episode, but still. Miyako and and Higa, they're just so adorable together. They are, you know, our main couple of this show. And of course, they're going to look good together no matter what. And they're, I mean, because like when you look at them together, there is sexual tension between these two. Plus to the fact is both of them explaining their families between last week's episodes and this week's episodes, especially, you know, Miyoko talking about her dad and her mom, especially about the fact that her dad has diabetes and her mom was like, you're not coming home until you have, you know, your blood sugar under control and it, and I'm like, oh, okay, well, you know, I'm like th- th- getting your blood su- your sugar is down. I get that. That's normal because, you know, that's life, but <laughs> not having your husband come home until he gets it down, that's a little messed up. So... <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> but like still, just imagine if both of these two had their families come together at a dinner party or whatever. Oh my God. Even if they got married and they were like, yeah, let's have our parents come together for some weird reason. Just our families and family members. Oh my God. I would love to be a fly on that wall. It probably would be a little embarrassing, but I think it would be really fun. But other than that, go ahead and pause the video. And I will see you guys in one second for episode four. Okay, episode four in three, <clears throat> two, one, go. I mean, we just was in summer. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> for you to. No one, I mean, hmm. oh, you're so precious. Saki. Excuse me? He tried. Honey, I mean, more and more, you're, you're, um, your aqua is just showing. Not as much. A little bit of your Kasumi is showing. Kasumi Samiri is showing a lot. But, um, yeah, what Kasumi Samiri did? Not really. I mean, girl. (laughs) I love her. She cute. She cute as a button, but the things that go on in her mind, you be like, we need to stay clear of her. I mean, she's scary. <laughs> like, straight up. I'm like, oh my God. I, I feel so bad for Hita. 
<sighs> Excuse me. I'm sorry. Oh my god. I'm trying to stay up. It's now 7.38. I gotta, I just, I'm almost done with my day. I am almost done. I just got like two more shows to do after this. I can do this. And then I can take me a shower if I'm able to take me a shower. And then I'm just going to be like this. Like. Mm. <laughs> and then I'm going to wake up at like 1 o'clock, maybe 2 or 3. And I'm going to be like, where did the time go? <laughs> I'm not staying up again tonight. I'm not. No. Mm-mm. I'm already tired as is right now. <laughs> but you, but Yuta, you like her though. She was just adorable ish. A little, you know, scary at times, but that's okay. Mm. For Adachi. I mean, hold up. This group got so many more romances. <laughs> Thank you. Wrong way. Yachiro. It's so And then. Because we had four people who were in love. And it took them, like. Three whole seasons for these couples to get together. And you telling me in this whole season, everybody got a love interest and they all gonna be in love with each other by the end of this series. Okay. <laughs> Let me be a little sarcastic. Okay. <laughs> I hope it works. If it can work for our previous cast, it can definitely work for this cast. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that she just like sensed that oh my god oh with the chocolate <laughs> I mean, honestly, Miyako. <laughs> I don't know what you put in that chocolate. Honestly. <laughs> I can't with myself. <sighs> oh, excuse me. Oh my god. Sleep is catching up with my ass. Nice to meet you. No, that's today. Oh, it is tomorrow. Oh my god. Well, um, you know... 
Yoko, at least you came today and not the day of. I mean, mm, you would have probably stressed her out, so at least you stressed her out today. that but like that was a random trivia thing to say in the moment God. <laughs> Who the heck wakes up at five AM? Do you know what I'm doing at five AM? Sleeping. I cannot believe you are here at five in the morning. Yeah, at 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, because it's 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. Who the freak? Hold up. Uh, unless it's a family member and it's a family or emergency. They ain't family. They ain't even married. They not boyfriend or girlfriend, nothing. But they ain't out. They got the... I, I know, right? You gotta love me, Uncle Spirit. <laughs> hey, puppy. It's so obvious she's spying on them. No, it just looks like they are. You can't take... <laughs> you can't change like that. It's so messed up. I, I don't think she can. But it's part of the rules that you could switch your rule the your wish last minute. So honestly, do you know how much money he put in there? Jesus.
Mm. You want the exact amount or do you want to round that up? So cute, I can't. <laughs> oh, oh, Bobby! No. The two cutest things in the show together. Okay, what? I mean, it's usually true, it just depends. Who knows? There are some people who do honestly have really good luck. Besides, you're also in the presence of a goddess herself. Oh, I thought, like, she was going to make an idea, like, okay, everybody, let's all go to the shrine and, you know, make some prayers together. <laughs> Yana, hi, baby. Exactly. I mean, I think we all knew. It, it's just, you know, we're, we're just waiting for you, honey. It's okay. It's like a slow burn. Mm-hmm. He might like your chocolate more a lot more than me, Nicole. You may not want to give it to him now. He looks really depressed. Did you eat it? You ate it, didn't you? No, Yana, no one could hate you. You are so adorable. With her cute resting bitch face, I love her so much. Oh my god. Yeah, exactly. You could just pretend that you ate it. Like you were supposed to do in episode one. But what did you do? You fucking ate it. Aww. Oh, okay. 
What cookie did you give to him? Don't eat the cookie. Okay, because I was about to say. Mm. I love the packaging. It's pretty. Oh, I see y'all. Um... Oh, I feel so bad for this dude. She gave him no <laughs> She really she oh you really gave him dog food. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Oh God. Miyako, you use some really weird combinations in chocolate. You and Umi from Irregular at Magic High School when she made her chocolate with espresso. And she ain't use sugar. When you make chocolate, you have to use sugar. It's supposed to be sweet. And then you put whatever you want in there. Please don't put curry in there. Espresso, yeah, that's okay. Especially if you want like a, you know, coffee tasting chocolate. Um, caramel, because your girl likes some caramel. Maybe even some nuts in there. Do not put coconut. I mean, not coconuts. Do not, yeah, coconut. Don't put coconut in your chocolate. Disgusting. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus. <laughs> I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> he dies because of his wafu and is brought back to life because of his dad. Oh, poor Higa. <laughs> Honestly, she is. <laughs> I like Mia because, um, Miyoko is that type of girl who really, really, really wants to kill somebody with her chocolate. I mean, if dies by the end of this series. I mean, technically, he's kind of dying after every single part where he eats some chocolate. I mean, I, I've never heard 
of someone getting killed because of a chocolate they ate. That's why it's called Death by Chocolate. Chocolaholics, oh my god. <laughs> but the fact that this girl came over his house between 4 and 5 o'clock in the morning, it still set me off. Hold up, man. I mean, like I said, they're not dating. They're not even, you know, um, engaged to each other or even married or anything. But you telling me this girl going to come over at between 4 and 5 o'clock in the morning just to see our cute, adorable raccoon. I mean. <laughs> I mean, number one, if someone is knocking at your door at 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning, mm-mm. Mm -mm, unless it's family, but you know, somebody would call first. I get the fact that she did call his dad, but still, I mean, damn, you couldn't at least call, um, he go first. Oh, that's me, literally me right now, because I want to sleep so bad. I guess math will make her up, no matter what, because baby loves math so much. She watches something about math, and she has energy just like that. She's so cute. Oh my god, he made so fucking precious baby girl. Like, uh, she's so cute. I, I just, you know, I want a plushie of her. She's so freaking adorable. Even though probably this show, oh my god, I hit it again. This show possibly has no merch for it, because of course the show is over. But still, if they were selling merch of this series, I would definitely buy stuff, honestly. But yes, I mean, really with Miyoko and Higa, like, it, it's that sexual attention that they have. They're just made for each other. And when you truly see that two characters are made for each other, they're, we're going to see, you know, how they're made for each other, why they're made for each other, how long is it going to take for these two to get, to get together. I mean, this show is only really um, one whole season, and we're already now four episodes into it, so by what i think what episode 12 also episode 13 they gotta at least maybe get together by the end of the same thing with yuta and shio but their relationship is more complicated in a way same thing with um adachi and kind of what's her face because they look good together as well i mean honestly you have people <laughs> characters in this show who really at the end of the day look super duper good together and you're just wanting and hoping that they get together because like when sato and yachiro finally got together that was the best thing for me because i was like loving that couple since day one now our other couple it was mm, there were times because i was like no i was like because i i was thinking like Let's say the working series got a movie, which in a way with the last kind of episode, it, it kind of is, but it was more like a TV movie. But when I'm thinking of a movie movie, I'm thinking of something that's like almost two hours, maybe an hour and 45 minutes or something like that. But let's say like it could happen later on in the series. I mean, I would still like to see, you know, our two main couples go on a date, things like that. Normal things that couples do, because I mean... We got to see it. We got you to and fucking Sato because that was the best date ever. They went out drinking. He embraces her. I fangirl. Like, you, I, we will never have that moment again with this series. And who knows? It may happen again with these with the rest of these episodes that I got to watch for this OVA season. But who freaking knows? I may never have a moment like that again in possibly any of the animes that I see. I may see, like, two people who are so in love and who are meant for each other. And then at the same time, we may not get a moment that is going to make me, like, fangirl, cry, ask it, like, be a hot mess. <laughs> who knows? I mean, I don't know, honestly. But seriously, like, because that date and that moment between those two and then plus him, like, confessing and then they get, I mean, they're finally together by the end of the freaking series. Like, I couldn't. There was too much. Like, it happened in two different episodes. So I'm just like, I can't. Like, really. But yeah. He got... <laughs> Cool. they're just meant for each other so here's hoping that by the end of the final episode of this OVA season 
they do end up together. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episodes three and four of season four of working. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matcha Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for everybody else. And next Friday for the Patreons for episodes five and six. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.